Hello everybody, and whatever few people that actually watch me, I'm here with my f good friend Vulp Erebus, and today we are going to pretty much go on the worst day of our lives by watching My Little Pony Friendship is Magic, Season 1, Episode 1. And today we get to see what the hell all the bronies are on about. <laughs> you have anything to say? <laughs> Uh, maybe later. Not right now. Alright. Uh, so yeah, this is going to be a reaction video. Obviously, we're going to have to react to it. So, uh, let it all spill out as it comes. <laughs> Alright, so have your mouse over the play button. And, oh, uh, let me go into full screen here. Oh, wait. Where are my choice for this website? Allow... I'm going to have to put this Skype icon thing in the corner here. And, uh, yes, this is my first, basically my first uh, little submission that I'm going to be calling uh, Furries React 2. And, oh, I'll probably name it something else because I found out that that name may already be taken on YouTube, but whatever. Furries React 2, friend, uh, my Little Pony Friendship is Magic Episode 1. Mouse over the play button. Whoops, whoops, whoops. It played automatically for some reason. So mouse anywhere on the video and click play in. We're going to sync it here. 3, 2, 1, play. Once upon, Once a, time. upon a time, in the magical land of Equestria. There were two regal sisters who ruled together and created harmony for all the land. To do this, the eldest used her unicorn powers to raise the sun at dawn. The younger brought out the moon to begin the night. Thus, I should probably say that uh, in balance for their kingdom and this their is subjects, kind of semi-blind in that I've watched this before, but I've actually somehow managed to beat the memories out of my skull. <laughs> But shunned and slept through her so, night. Seen it before, don't remember day, anything about the it. The younger unicorn refused <laughs> to lower the moon to make way for the dawn. The elder sister tried to reason with her, but the bitterness in the young one's heart had transformed her into a wicked mare of darkness. Night a wicked mare of, of darkness. Night. Yes, okay. She shroud the land in eternal <laughs> night. Reluctantly, the elder sister harnessed the most powerful magic known to Ponyville. The elements of harmony. Are you by any chance getting any kind of skippage here? Uh, no, it's playing pretty smooth for me. Huh, I'm getting a little bit of skipping. I'm guessing it's staying on track though, so I don't really know. And harmony has been maintained. I'm at uh, 125. And now at 130. You at, you there? I think I'm like a. A couple of seconds ahead of you. Ah, okay. Yeah. That's close enough. Oh, the skippage might actually- Oh god, the theme! Not the theme! 30 old men actually fucking like this. Yeah! What? I'm sorry, but what? I said I can't believe 30 old I know, men No, 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 I, he I heard you. I'm saying, what? Why do people like this? You wanna I have no idea. So many so colors. I got a uh, lot all of pinks and to catch up on. light blues and purples and that pastel Does that yellow. Do anything except right? study. I think she's more interested in books than friends. I know I've heard of the elements of harmony. Oh man, we are pissing off so many people by doing this. Was wait, was that was that the uh, the human lover? Wait, what do they call her? Lyra? Lyra? I don't know. Lyra the harp playing pony, whatever. I don't know. There you are. No, 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 isn't that Octavia? Quick, find me that I don't know. Copy of predictions and prophecies. Maybe that's something I, else. I think it is Octavia. Well, it was a gift for Moondancer, but uh, maybe it's DJ Pond Three. I don't know. You know we don't have time for that sort of thing. But we're on a break. Did he just say we're on a plank? I don't know, I missed that part. Eh. No, 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 no! Ugh! Mike! It's over here! 
Yeah, hold on, I gotta find out if the uh, skipping that I'm getting is artificially increasing the time. I am at 3.35. 3.35, I'm... I'm at about 8 seconds ahead of you now. Ah. Yeah, so... Well, we should probably, we should probably check the time at the same time. I'm now at 3.50. 3.50, yeah, I'm, I'm 8 seconds ahead of you, exactly 8 seconds. Jeez. Because we said, we said, three, wait, you said, you said 3.50 or 4.50? Oh, I said, I said 3.50. Oh yeah, never mind, it was, yeah, I was at 3.58, so it's exactly 8, I'm exactly 8 seconds ahead of you. Alright. Take a note, please, to the princess. So yeah, the uh, the skipping them gang is artificially separating us on the timeline. Led me to discover yeah. that we are on the precipice of disaster. Hold on, Prissy, Prissy. Threshold. T H R E S H O L D. Brink. I think. Uh, Wait, what was that? Really Threshold. For you see, the Spike was trying to spell threshold. Threshold? Yeah. She's about to return to a yeah, T H R E S H H O L D. I think you included H two times there, but whatever. I await your quick response. Your faithful student, Twilight Sparkle. Twilight Sparkle. Got it. Great. Send it. Now? Of course. Uh, I don't know, Twilight. Princess Celestia's a little busy getting ready for the summer sun celebration. Okay, that's the shot that got so many people interested. Okay. Wait, what was that? It was about eight seconds ago on your part. Basically, when Twilight was looking out the window. Okay, okay. It's on its way. Wait, I did hit the record. I gotta check real quick to see if I hit the record button. The princess Trust yeah, I did. Okay. In all the years she's okay. been my mentor, she's never for once. I was worried that, that I <laughs> forgot to press it. <laughs> I knew she would want to take immediate action. Did he just burp up a letter? I think so. Most faithful student Twilight, you know that I value your diligence and that I trust you completely. Mm -hmm. But you simply must stop reading those dusty old books. <gasps> <laughs> really? <laughs> there is more to a young pony's life than studying. So I'm sending you to surprise <coughs> preparations for the summer sun celebration in this year's location, Ponyville. Mm -hmm. And I have an even more essential task for you to complete. Those, those, friends. those horses are galloping on air. They're yeah. flapping their wings and galloping on the air. Doesn't that make you happy? Yes. That does not make any sense. You know why? Because I'm right. I'll check on the preparations as fast as I can. Wings should be sufficient. To the library to find right. proof of Nightmare Moon's return. Then when will you make friends like the princess said? She said to check on preparations. I am her student, and I'll do my royal duty. But the fate of Equestria does not rest on me making friends. Oh, there's... Immediate introduction to you, Big Mac. Sir. He's included in one of the Maybe first the shots of Ponyville. Ponyville oh god, and here comes the pink one. Yep. Come on, Twilight, just try. Hello? Great, car's outside. <laughs> well, that was interesting, alright. For some reason I actually thought that was coming from the uh the video itself. <laughs> but, uh, what, no, no, that was outside. Ponyville. That was outside. Okay. Sweet Sorry. Acres. Yeah! <sighs> Let's get this over with. Good afternoon. Oh, and here's My the background, Tony. Sparkle. Well, how to do, Miss Twilight? A pleasure making your acquaintance. I'm Applejack. We here at Sweet Apple Acres sure do like making new friends. Friends? Actually, I... Uh, so, what can I do you for? <laughs> <clears throat> well, I am in fact here to supervise preparations that for the summer so sun stupid. celebration. That was like, in that... Of the food? Twilight's Weird. still Sugar. shaking her... Would you care to sample some? What is it? As Hoof? As it doesn't take too long. Paw? Yeah. Thing? Oh. Soon. Yeah. Soon, every pony. 
And here was the introduction to one of the stupidest, stupidest parts of the Brony movement. Thanks, Every pony. Right. Apple bumpkin. Red gallop. Red delicious. Golden delicious. Caramel apple. Apple strudel. Apple tart. Baked apples. Apple brioche. Apple cinnamon crisp. Big Macintosh. Apple bloom. And Granny Smith. Up and at him, Granny Smith. We got guests. <laughs> Wait, how's she rocking in the chair, having both hooves on the ground, and still managing to sleep? That has to be uncomfortable for her back legs. Okay, well, I can see the yep. food situation is handled, so we'll be on our way. Aren't you gonna stay for brunch? Sorry, but we have an awful lot to do. Aww. This is actually starting to make my back hurt. Fine. <laughs> Food's all taken care of. Next is weather. Ugh, <coughs> oh, I ate too much pie. Hmm, there's supposed to be a Pegasus pony named Rainbow Dash clear in the clouds. Well, she's not doing a very Is it just me, or does each she? character's introduction get more and more irritating? Pretty much. Yeah. yeah. That's pretty much how it's going to, I think that's how it's going to keep on going. Yep. That, te that tends to be a trend, trend, that's the word, in these uh, kids vid kid shows. Oops. So wait, she, she just got Twilight all muddy, and then got, it got her in a rain shower, which would... Technically, only served to get her more muddy. Right? Because she was still standing in the mud. Let me guess. You're Rainbow Dash. The one and only. Why? You heard of me? I heard you're supposed to be keeping the sky clear. <sighs> I'm Twilight Sparkle, and the princess sent me to check on the weather. Yeah, yeah, that'll be a snap. I'll do it in a jiffy. Oh, I recognize that shot. I recognize that from, um, from, uh, what was it? Dressed Up Mom. What? Yeah. Don't worry, you'll probably see it after this. Okay. It's a uh, Hot Diggy Demon did a bunch of... The, uh, did something called Pony.Mob. It was a six-part series. Oh, uh, okay. Big joke on the, uh, on the whole My Little Pony thing. It was actually pretty good. I'm gonna say right now to the bronies that are seriously pissed off at me right now that, uh, I really do enjoy the brony culture. I enjoy the videos and the content the bronies have made. I just don't like the show. Right. You should see the look on your face. You're I can speak with you on that one. Sparkle. Yeah. I can't wait to hang out some more. I really do like the stuff that Bronies have come up with. The uh, comics, the fan fictions, all that. Wait! It's kind of pretty once you get used to it. <laughs> Decorations. Beautiful. I actually don't think grown men would be half as interested in this show if they if they cut out the butt cleavage. Yeah, that, that's what I was pointing out before with the one, and they got it right here again. Right. No, no, no. Oh goodness, no. How are my spines? Are they straight? How are my spines? Good Seriously? Just a moment, please. I'm in the zone as twer. Oh yes, Sparkle always does the trick, does it not? Why, Rarity, you are a talent. Now, um. Sparkles always does the you? trick. Tell that to Twilight. And I don't mean Twilight Spark, I mean Twilight the movie and the books. Oh, you mean my what? main? Well, she, uh, Rarity just I'm said Sparkles, something about Sparkles hair. always oh, does the trick. What about your hair? While dealing with the uh, decorations or whatever. Yeah. We should probably check the time again, see how big the difference has gotten. No. It's just gotten uh, too... Huh? Too yellow. Too what? Okay, tell, tell, tell me what time you're on. It's 12.56. Wow, I I am way ahead of you. I was I was at thirteen minutes and twenty seconds. Jeez. Yeah. You should count it up. It's now thirteen ten. Oh, 
Yeah, I was at uh, 1333. 23 seconds now. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, the recording software really takes a lot out of this tiny ass laptop. So. Emeralds? What was I thinking? Let me get you some rubies. Quick, before she decides to dye my coat a new color. <laughs> Wasn't she wonderful? Fine, no, she Eva. wasn't, Spike. What's next on the list? <clears throat> oh, uh, music. It's the last one. You know what? Do you want to, do you want to uh, roll yours back a bit? Um. Sure. T t tell me what. Tell me which. Uh, where you're on it again? I am right now approaching 14 minutes. Right now. Excuse me. 14. Sir. I mean, no offense, but your rhythm is just a teeny tiny bit off. You're still on 14. I uh, it just moved on to t one, fourteen ten. Two, one, two, Hang on, you should probably pause first and let me get to. Uh... All right, all right. Um, sorry for anybody who's watching, but uh, my computer sucks, so I have to do this. Three, two, two, one, one, go. I didn't mean to frighten your birds. I'm just here to check up on the music, and it's sounding <coughs> beautiful. Yeah, this is. This is right here is probably the one character that I would have wished like Melly had watched with us with, uh, for for this. What's your name? But oh well. Right. I'm Fluttershy. I'm sorry. What was that? Uh, my name is Fluttershy. It's probably the least <laughs> annoying character in this entire show. Are you sure? <laughs> What's that? Are you sure with that noise she just made? Looks like your birds are back. Uh, so I guess everything's in order. Well, except, except for the weird screechy noise, and yeah, she's the okay. least annoying character. Yeah. That, was easy. yeah. that much I can agree with if you take that one. Oh, I've never seen ah. a baby dragon before. He's so cute. Well, well. And well, if we can exclude well, that. He talks. I didn't know dragons could talk. Yeah. That's just so incredibly wonderful. I, I just don't even know what to say. Well, in that case, we better be going. Oh, wait, wait. What's his name? I'm Spike. Hi, Spike. I'm Fluttershy. Wow, a talking dragon. And what do dragons talk about? Well, what do you? I'm guessing Twilight is wishing she stayed quiet. Everything. Right. Story a cute little purple and life. green egg. Well, up until today. Is that really what you just described yourself as? How would he even know that? So yeah. <laughs> get here so fast. This is where I'm staying while in Ponyville, and my poor baby dragon needs his sleep. No, I don't. Aw, look at that. He's so sweepy he can't even keep his widow balance. Poor thing. You simply must get him to bed. Yes. Yes, we'll get right on that. Well, good night. Huh. Rude much. Sorry, Spike. But I have to Oh, I see streamers. Nightmare Moon is coming and we're running yep. out of time. I just need to be alone. Here so comes the pink a one. Crazy ponies trying to make right. friends all the time. Now, where's the light? <laughs> yep. <laughs> yep. Most annoying fucking one. Yep. Most annoying. Libraries are supposed to be Most annoying 2013 or whenever the fuck this show was made. Yeah. Oh, and I even see Derpy in the background without her broken eyes. Oh, yeah. And I apparently see Colgate. And if you're new and that you hadn't met anyone yet, and if you haven't met anyone yet, you must not have any friends. And if you don't have any friends, then you must be lonely. And that made me so sad. And I had an idea. And like I said, I am pretty much a culture brony. I only like the culture of bronies. So I know about some of the spare characters. Right. Are you a rat, sugar I'm pretty sure every pony in the background has been raped by a crazy bony of brony at one point or another. With the body pillows they make? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Hot sauce. Did you really just do that? <laughs> this show is so fucking crazy. Uh, hey Twilight! Pinkie Pie's starting 
You're the tail and the pony. Wanna play? No! All the ponies in this I'm really trying to take this show as a children's show as it's meant to be, but the regular bronies or the the weirder bronies have really ruined it. <laughs> right. Here I thought I'd have time to learn more about the elements of harmony. But, silly me, all this ridiculous friend making has kept me from it. Legend has it that on the longest day of the thousandth year, the stars will aid in her escape, and she will bring about everlasting night. I hope the princess was right. I hope it really is just an old ponytail. Come on, Twilight! It's time to watch the sunrise! An old ponytail? Wouldn't that be like I don't know, what do you what do you call a gender neutral young horse? Gender neutral. Full I'm not sure. Cold, I guess. Uh, okay, young fool's tail. It should have been old fool's tail. Phillies and gentle This show should have been calling it. It is my great pleasure to oh, the beginning of the oh. summer sun celebration. In just a few moments, our town will witness the magic of the sunrise and celebrate this, the longest day of the year. And now, it is my great honor to introduce to you the ruler of our land, the very pony who gives oh, all the craters just disappeared from the moon. Shit's happening. The wise, right. the bringer of harmony to all of Equestria. Ready? Princess Celestia! This can't be good. Remain calm, every pony. There must be a reasonable explanation. Oh, oh, I love guessing games. Is she hiding? You're a fucking idiot. She's gone. <laughs> Couldn't agree more. The only cool thing to have come from this episode so far. Right. Finally, Nightmare, just kill them all. Yeah. Little sun loving faces. What did you do with our princess? Why? Am I not royal enough for you? Don't you know who I am? Ooh, ooh, more guessing games. Um, Pokey Smokes. How about Queen Minnie? No, Black Snooty, Black Snooty! Not an armored pony, a fucking armored horse. Now that I have been imprisoned right. for they actually do one years. cool thing with this did episode. You not the legend? Did you not see the signs? I did. And I know who you are. <coughs> You're the mayor in the moon. Nightmare Moon. <gasps> well, well, well. Brutally murderous. Yep. Then you also know why I'm here. Please do. You're here to... To... <laughs> Please spare our suffering from the show any longer. Ponies, for right. it was your last. From this moment forth, the night will last forever. <laughs> oh, geez, what a horrible concept. So it'd be night all the time. Sure, all the plants would die, but hey, at least we get to hang out at nightclubs all fucking night. Forever. Right. Is going to the dogs. Hey, doggy. So yeah, that would seem to be the end of the episode. Ordinary pound lies the secret headquarters. Secret but fun of an extraordinary bunch of hounds. Here are the pound puppies. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, end it there because why well, go through a through a commercial of what is that dog show? Cartoon dog show? I think so. <coughs> Well, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and end it there. So, uh, this is for, a part for YouTube. <clears throat> uh, thank you for watching. If you've decided to watch, uh, like it if you enjoyed our con uh, enjoyed our commentary, our reactions. Uh, if you didn't like it, leave a comment to, I don't know, whine about it. And uh, if you want to see more, subscribe. And see you all next time.